All right, little bros, making a beat with uh, some of the counts, uh, samples he put up in his new splice pack last week. Um, counts one of my favorite producers, easily. He's one of the reasons inspired me to do these these beat making videos too. You know, I don't gonna do them the same way he does, like him and Kaylin Ellis do, but those two dudes for sure. Major influences on on what I'm trying to do right now. Uh, so shout out him and Kaylin Ellis. So yeah, I got this uh, this sample. That was it originally. This is the addition. So this took some of it, chopped it a little bit, and sequenced it out a little longer. Did that, and I got this little uh, clave perk loop from the Counts Pack 2. obsessed with foley and just like natural like real world sounds of like anything so uh, yeah on splice i found uh, this whole like camera sounds pack wonderful <laughs> all right so i took that sound and i uh i time stretched it in a couple different ways so now it sounds like this so now in in the pattern. Little snare. Little snare. Kick, motherfucker, kick, motherfucker, kick. Decided to redo the hi hats. So I took that piano. I uh I bounced it out, I bounced it in place, made it a wave file so I could uh, time stretch it, basically. So I took it from, um, what the hell? So I turned it into this. In your face. I still can't really play bass lines that well, like real bass lines. 808s can be kind of like, I get 808s, but yeah, I still not really, I'm not good at playing like actual natural acoustic sounding basses. Um, so I went to Splice and got a loop. I just uh, took some parts out that I wanted.